it's one that people I think really struggle with to know how to help children to engage with God and I would sort of think sharing Bible stories with people depending on what stories you're sharing may confuse them if they're Old Testament stories I think talking to them about Jesus and why Jesus came and and who God is and demonstrating who God is and expressing it in a in a way of love is, is good helping people to and your those children to have a relationship with love that they are unconditionally loved is the key now if you can help them to know you unconditionally love them then they will find it more easy to believe that the father unconditionally loves them so i wouldn't share bible stories i would share talks testimonies definitely of today where people have engaged god operate in the mystic realm have you know share some of the mystic stories of amazing things that they're doing in this amazing intimacy with god take it away from a book which was written to people about things 2000 years ago 4000 years ago and bring it up to date just share the things that god is doing today help them to realize that god's with them in intimacy today that he'll never leave them that he's in them help them to realize that they're already in relationship with god that they just don't know it yet help them to find that relationship and realize all the amazing thing god has done for them already now when it comes then to you know how how we help them with that relationship i would give them opportunities of encountering the spiritual realm the father um help him encounter the angelic realm and the angels that are with them help introduce them to the angels that are there to protect them and to look after them and do that in a very simple way you know five to 13 is a reasonable age range all of them have the capacity to be able to engage by closing their eyes and opening their heart and choosing to enter in through the door so i would start with jesus being in them and that they have access to him within and then i would use like let's say that jesus is knocking on the door inside you and he just wants you to open the door and welcome him in so you can have a relationship and he'll bring the father and the spirit with him so just open the door so close your eyes picture a door now if they're struggling to picture a door just say well think of the door our front door door to our house picture that door now this door is like a choice so you're opening the door and jesus is going to come and meet with you and he, the father will meet with you you'll find whatever that happens when you give the father an opportunity or jesus the opportunity he'll take it and you can help them say you might see something you might feel something you might sense something don't 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 try don't try hard just relax and let them feel and experience the presence of jesus and the father and the spirit and then from that experience god will reveal himself and he will reveal himself in love and try and perhaps talk to them about religious conditioning and beliefs that you had and help deconstruct that them well not deconstruct them because they probably don't have those beliefs but help them to avoid getting involved in the religious ideas about god and bring them into the true nature of god who's love and it, love is what they need to experience unconditional love no conditions brought into an intimate relationship through what jesus has already done for them and try and remove all of the works that they need to earn deserve be pleasing to god try and be obedient to god introduce relationship where the father will share his heart with them and then he'll help them to be the, the the person that they were created to be so help them to discover that they're fearfully and wonderfully made and god has a destiny for them and a purpose individually and they're all individually loved by god equally and god has a purpose for their life an adventure set it in terms that they could understand god wants to take you on adventure where you discover who you are and discover amazing things about this world and your part to play in it type make it exciting make it an adventure and a journey that every day they can experience god and they can walk together with god and their angels and god will lead them and god will be there to help them protect them and provide for them as they learn to trust him so sort of make it simple 
but you can do that in a way which doesn't overcomplicate it, but it actually does get to the point and reveals who God really is and then help them experience who God really is by simply doing small activations that opens a door for them to experience God within and then perhaps open a door that they can experience where God is in that realm, engaging the waterfall or the river of life or the garden where the father is. And you can open that through experience and just encourage them to activate their imagination and then begin to enter into what they what they can feel or see or sense but just make it as simple as possible but keep it based in love that will be my encouragement thank you for watching our youtube channel we really appreciate you taking the time if you enjoy these videos would you please take a moment to like comment and subscribe it really does help thank you very much